Rachel. What's up guys? It's Anna Marie and welcome to my channel. New Year equals New Year's resolutions. Usually. I suck at those. A lot of us suck at those. Every year that I try to do New Year's resolutions, I fail big time. This year, I'm just deciding to do something different. So I created a bucket list for 2016. And so I decided to do a bucket list. And at first I was gonna do like a hundred things, but I was like, that's kind of a lot. And then I thought maybe 50 things, but that's kind of a lot too. I, when I was trying to get the ideas together, I was like struggling to get to 30. I ended up coming up with about 35 ideas or things I wanted to do or accomplish this year. And then I was like, 35 is such a weird number. 35 holds no kind of weight in my life. So I decided I would choose 23 of those things. I chose 23 because this year is my Jordan year birthday. I'm turning 23 on the 21st of this month. So I was like, why not? And then I could maybe do like a thing of doing however, whatever birthday I'm turning. So like next year I'll do 24 because I'll be turning 24. So anywho, so let's jump into the bucket list. My first thing is to fly first class. I actually had this as two things, but I combined them as one. So the first is the fly, fly, fly. Why can't I say fly? Fly first class. I've never flown first class before and also to get drunk on an airplane. I know that kind of sounds crazy, but my best friend came up with that one day. She was like, you know what? I want to try getting drunk on an airplane one day. And I was like, hey, I'm going to add that to my bucket list. Number two, go horseback riding. I've never been horseback riding. Some of these things I have done before, like in the past, or um, I was young, so I wanted to do them again. Some of these things I've never done before. Horseback riding is one. I've gotten on a pony, but that doesn't count. I was like as a little kid. So I really want to go like full-blown horseback riding. Number three, I want to surprise someone. I don't know what kind of surprise. Maybe, I don't know. Surprise someone is just the goal. Just surprise them. <laughs> Four, you ride on the back of a motorcycle. I can't recall if I've ever done that before, but it's gonna happen this year. Number five, wine tasting. Or like, you know those wine tasting, um, wine tasting and painting classes where you do both like wine and design, maybe? I wanna do one of those. It's number six to swim with dolphins. I have wanted to swim with dolphins my entire life. Like from the time I was born, I just knew I needed to swim with dolphins. Like I have to. So that is on my bucket list for 2016. It has to get done. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. I am doing that this year. Number seven, I want to start a pay it forward chain. And if you've ever seen the movie Pay It Forward, it's kind of like you do one person does a nice thing and then you tell that person to pay it forward. So, or, you know, say I were to buy your, like you're a stranger and I bought your lunch today, then I would tell you to pass it on or pay it forward and you pay, do something nice. A lot of times they do the same thing um, but you just do a nice thing for somebody else and then you tell that person to pay it for it and it just keeps on going to send happiness around the world. Number eight is to meet a celebrity. I've met a couple of people before um, in school. I was on a committee where I met a few celebrities, but it wasn't like cool. I was just backstage helping set up stuff. So. I really want to just like meet a celebrity, like walk up to somebody and be like, sup, so-and-so, maybe, I don't know. Number nine, go to an acting audition. I wanted to act almost my whole entire life. From the time I was little, I always wanted to be an actress. That was like my dream goal of the world. And then I kind of put that dream to the side because of uh, just going to school and I had, People kind of tell me, no, I shouldn't do that. So 
Now I think I'm kind of just like, try it maybe. I really want to go to an acting audition and just see what happens. Guess who knows? I just think it'll be fun. Number 10, I would like to visit another country. The only place outside of America I have been is Canada and um, I love that trip. I enjoyed Canada a whole lot, but it's time to uh, broaden my horizons. I want to go somewhere like super cool, extravagant, I don't know. So number 11, a boxing class. I just watched Creed a couple of days ago and when I saw that movie, I was like, I can do that. I have to go to a boxing class. Like. Well, you know what I mean. I'm gonna go to a boxing class. Number 12, indoor parachuting. I don't know if that's what it's called. I think it's, you know those things where you like go in the little room and you're in like the little outfit and you have the goggles on and you're like flying in the air. I don't know what that's called. I Someone told me it was called indoor parachuting. I don't know if that's really the name, but I want to do that this year. Number 13 is to host a party. I've actually heard of something called a silent disco, I think is the name of the party. If it's not, I'm going to call it the silent disco. So if you haven't heard, a silent disco is basically like everyone comes in, listens to their own music, and um, like you're listening to your own music and dancing to your own music, and everyone's listening to their own music. I don't know, it's hard to explain, but I'll explain that when we get there. Number 14, learn to make sushi. I love sushi so much. I could eat sushi every single day. Well, maybe not every day, but I love sushi. So I would love to stop spending money on sushi and to actually just be able to make my own sushi. Number 15, I want to get a new car by the end of 2016. I have had the same car for a few years now. It's not that old, but I just want a new car by the end of the year. Number 16, I want to go on a cruise. I've never been on a cruise, so I think that'll be a really cool thing to do this year is to make sure I get on a cruise. Number 17, to form a habit. Not actually a habit, but I want to do something. You know, they say it takes 21 days. I think that number's actually changed recently, but it takes 21 days to form a habit. So I was thinking I just want to stick to something for 21 days or form a habit. Number 18, do a photo shoot. I've never done a photo shoot before, so I just thought it would be something really cool to do, maybe with friends or something. Number 19, I want to visit a zoo. I have been to the zoo numerous times before, but never as an adult. So I just think that would be a really cool thing to do. See, and who doesn't want to see cute little animals at the zoo? Number 20, I want to ride, do like a helicopter ride or fly a helicopter. Fly a helicopter would be so cool. So I really might try to do something like that. 21, do a dance class. I used to dance a little back in high school and middle school and stuff, but I really want to do like a hip hop dance class, some kind of dance class, really anything, just to see if I know how to do anything again. 22, I want to bake a professional cake. I think cakes, some quick cakes, or people that can cake, bake it. Bake cakes. <laughs> no, why to start laughing that much? Bake cakes are so cool, like the professional cakes with the different designs and the edible stuff on the outside. If I, I've always wanted to do that. So if I can learn how to make a professional cake, I will be happy. And number twenty-three is to ride on a hot air balloon. I did one time, I believe, when I was in kindergarten. Um, so it's so I really want to try to do that again and see what it's like. So there it is, my bucket list for 2016. Thanks for tuning in. Make sure you like if you liked it. And make sure you subscribe if you want to see if I even accomplished these things, how I accomplished these things. 
And once again, thank you so, so much for watching my video. Make sure you connect with me on all my social media, on my Instagram, my Twitter, and my Snapchat, which are linked down below. Thank you. Thumbs up. Subscribe.